Luke. We're going to play some Tortuga 2 today. So, let's get started. And we start off next to this uh, sleeping pirate. I'm going to go to the left. And uh, we see some stuff here. We can take the cheese. We take the egg. Open the drawer and take out this detonation cord. Also, if you like, you can pop the cork on that. I like to do that. And there's this cool-looking mannequin here. You don't ever use him. I just think that he looks really cool. <laughs> Go to the right, and we see some guy knocked out in the middle of the hallway, and there's, like, a knife and a frying pan dug into the, like, a window and a painting or something. So if you go here, this pirate chef wants four of something. If you go into here, you can take an egg, go over to the cannon, and take the egg and another egg from the cannonball stack. Now you have four eggs. Pirate Chef was talking about four eggs. So now the Pirate Chef gets distracted. You can click on the top right, and this is like a shelf. You can take you can take the Pirate Metal. You don't actually need it. It doesn't do anything. But you need the matches. And you can take this key. Let me show you this. So this is a yellow key. Go back to the Sleeping Pirate and go up the stairs and click this little piece of wood. You get another key. Now you might notice that they correspond with the locks here. And you're thinking, well, maybe you're not thinking, but some people think it's the way out. But you see some pirates partying up here, and they kind of are angry with you that you're disturbing the party, and so they hit you with a bottle. So that's not the way out. That's just a red herring. Uh, go back to where the pirate kitchen is and use your money bag to put a coin in this little candy dispenser. You get a pirate candy. You don't eat it out, however. This mouse thinks that he owns these barrels, but he doesn't like the cheese, so you, alternatively, you can give him the pirate candy. Now, pop the corks on these, and it's gunpowder, which is pretty useful. Now, put the detonation cord in it, light it with the matches, and if you notice, the skull turned green up here, and so you are safe. The pirate ship explodes, and the mouse goes flying past. And uh, this looks to be about the only room that stayed safe. So move this floating barrel out of the way. I'm guessing the octopus and the uh, parrot from the first episode escaped. So move the two boards out of the way. And there you go. You've escaped the pirate ship. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been phase one.